All right, so we're about to go do some shark fishing at the surf. Problem is, it takes a lot of preparation. We got some of the stuff here, got a lot of stuff in here, and I always seem to forget something. And of course, the big guy right there. We do have a secret up our sleeves. Let me show you what that is. Well, I guess I can't really show you, but here's half of it. This is half of a Jack Gravel. Finally got some proper shark bait. As always, Jeff along for the ride to help me run some baits. Good. Ooh, damn, that's definitely the best it's looked. Is that how it goes? <laughs> This is the best. I think this is the most efficient way to open a bag. Oh, look at that guy. Oh, that's a solid chunk of meat right there. All right, in the meantime, I'm gonna run the good old pin fathom right here on the, uh, on the smaller rod. I'm actually gonna run it out in the kayak, get it out there a little bit closer, a lot closer than the other shark rods, but that's very good for bull reds and also can be sh small sharks out there. And I do got that smaller hook for for the bull reds but we also still have the leader just in case the shark does get a hold of it and we're going to use a little bit of whiting a little bit of whiting for bait oh dude this is a good one all right i'm going to set the drag now man nice dude Whoa, that's that's a good one, huh? yeah it is dude it's going to be that might be a four footer baby oh you think oh yeah he's on there dude this might be our best one. Maybe, Hopefully. maybe breaching four feet. <laughs> Dude, that, what are the chances? I was just standing here messing with this rod and it hit. I know. Right then. Dang it, there's a car coming by. They're going to see me. Should I just lay the rod over when they pass by? <laughs> Dude, I literally do that sometimes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's the old school tactics. Yeah, for sure. I'm glad this is not the far drop, man. I'm getting tired. <laughs> yeah. Oh Wait, wow! No, it was long. Oh, it's oh a it shark. is a shark! Yes, that was awesome. Nice, nice man. Not a big one, but it might be our biggest one yet. Dude, the whole time driving down the beach, we didn't see anyone hooked up, dude. I guess we are just the best fishermen out there. There it goes. Dude, that's our biggest one. <laughs> Woo! Let's go, man. Let's freaking go, man. I'm yeah, baby. Yeah! Let's go. Yeah. A little bit, little bit spookier than a mantis shrimp. Man, I don't want him to be flopping around when I'm holding him. Woohoo! He's gonna come back around! He's gonna come back, he ain't coming back. <laughs> now he's gonna come back for you, to bite you. Dude! <laughs> yes! I finally got Jeff, dude. Finally! You never I'm fall. I'm not sending you that footage. You never fall for any prank, but I got yeah. him finally. <laughs> yeah, I, I wanted to pick him up, but that's a perfect size that you don't want to pick up because yeah. still, they can still bite their tails like that. Yeah. All right, so listen up. You're gonna be hearing the clicker right here, but that's not the rod I'm holding. Jeff is actually running out a shark bait in the kayak, and that's what's clicking. But at the same time, it seems I might have something on the rod right here. We have a big bait on here, don't we? It's going slack, dude. It is literally going slack. Literally. Oh, that's kind of spooky. What if we catch one with Jeff's running the bait out there? Let's find out what's going on here. Dude, there, I think there is something on here. I just felt something. Oh my gosh, it's just so hard, so hard to tell with mono. Especially this much mono. And Jeff's coming right on the line, dude. No, we're going right over each other. Oh no. I don't want him to get on the line. Oh, did we? Okay, we're good. Oh, I got one, a small, small guy. Wow, it was a guy after all. That's why I like to check it because if you leave, you get a little bites. 
and you leave a guy on there for a long time, he might not make it. Well, dude, right when you were walking that bait out, yours was clicking, and I saw this, I saw this rod going, and I thought it, it was yours <laughs> clicking, but yeah, it was this guy. Wow, she looks like. Let me cut this <coughs> one real, real quick. So, uh, dude, that's a decent one. I would. Wow, man, that's a cool looking shark right there, dude. Oh, it does have a green tinge to it. Thank you, cool guy. All right, buddy. Jesus! He's a fighter, that's for sure. <laughs> Dang, dude. Thank you, sir. Dang, he obliterated that bait. Dude, that's awesome. Wasn't that a decent sized bait on there? Yeah, it was. What was it? The jack? Uh huh. Woo! What you need there? Ooh, nice. Nice hook set, too. It's always hard because these these hooks have huge barbs. So, I think it came out. Oh, yes, nice. nice. Look at that. Easy. Obliterated this bait, dude. Yeah, that's awesome. All right, it's gonna back. You gonna behave? Oh, oh, I got you, bud. Oh, shark wrangler. There we go. Woo Let's get this guy back in the water. There he goes. He's off to the races. Woohoo! Dude, we get it. We did it. We each got one today, finally. Dude, yo, you came in right over it. I know. I swam right over the shark. Didn't <laughs> yeah. I? Hopefully, these sharks are red meat eaters. Cause look at this yeah. meat. Show the meat, Jeff. Show the meat. Look at that. Some nice meat. That's boy. shark bait, if I've ever seen it. What your arm, do you want in there? Uh, just crop it like. Oh. Oh. Bye. Nice. That's a run. <laughs> All right. Oh, dude, it feels decent. Yeah. Dude, the fathom again. You, uh, you want your GoPro? Yeah, I see him splashing out there. Oh, sweet. <laughs> Woohoo, he's coming right in for me. Oh, he's got a remora. Look at that. Oh, where'd he go? He left. Oh, there he is. Can you guys even believe this right now? I can't even believe it. <laughs> That's pretty funny. <laughs> Alright. It's not that big actually, I'm just kidding. <laughs> He's out of there. Dude, sick. He's gone. I'm surprised we even got a run from that. He was so tiny. Really? That's pretty crazy. <laughs> Alright, night is almost upon us. And we're gonna run one more bait out and then we'll have we should have four out with some good baits too. And we got Jeff currently trying to disassemble this jack or <laughs> I got it, man. He's getting in there. Ugh. And that will be our final bait. A short drop on that guy. I should have probably got rid of that little water droplet. But let's get ready for hopefully some bites. That's like a, I don't even know, but they were snacking. Something was snacking on that. Well, it, we, we had big bites, but it got picked clean. That's one of the problems with having frozen baits. They're a little bit mushier. Little stuff can eat it more easily. And this just got destroyed. Maybe crabs and little fishies, little sharks. They had a little bit of a Thanksgiving feast on this. All right, fellers. Well, I'm gonna have to break the fourth wall a little bit here, but I got home to edit this video and I noticed that about half my files had no audio. So that was a little bit of a problem, but you know what, I did what I could with the video. But let me show you what I have in my freezer because I know today we did not catch the biggest sharks of all time. I know they're pretty small sharks, but in 2018, we're gonna catch some giant sharks, maybe on some of these baits I have right here in my freezer. 